Magic Musing Family. I am the Earl of Florida, and no, I am still not your humble host. But I will be your guide, your pilot, for our sojourn this evening. What is the Watcher Files? If you don't know what it is, you can click up here and find, or it might be over here, and find the link to some of our others and watch and find out. But if you just want me to break it down to you, we watch things and comment on things. I know. Intriguing, right? So today we will be watching the trailer for The Last Boys of the Demeter. And, as usual, breaking down the content. So, sit back, put on those seatbelts, and enjoy the ride, because here we go. Evil is on board. Evil is on board. Powerful. Oh, that looked sufficiently creepy. We call him, we call him Dracula. Dracula. Oh, it's Batman! That was definitely Batman. I don't care who you are, that was Batman. The Demeter on charter from Romania to London. Oh, it's Sir Davos the Onion Knight. Rest is all. Okay, you're going to pay me a lot of money to take a creepy box on board. You know what, people that traveled to see back 100 years ago, good for them. I... that would be so terrible. Oh, hey, look, we know this guy. He's from The Walking Dead. He disappeared in, like, season 7. But he didn't die on screen, so he could have been alive. And that other guy... Our time for time we arrival in London. We know how it ends, but let's not... Oh, it's a puppy! Everybody loves the puppies! Puppy was named Huckleberry. I wonder if it's fit. Knock on wood like this. Isn't that like the good luck knock? Knock on wood? To me, it's a fine dog, no doubt. It's a fine dog. Knock on wood. Everything's good, everything's okay. No dog. Don't go to... Oh, that's not good. Run away. Save yourself. Don't... Oh! Oh! That's not a dog. Something ripped that, well, it apart. Something ripped it apart. That's... Oh, that's... Stock. That's gruesome. This looks like a bite. It looks like a bite. Yeah, that's definitely due off of, uh... Guardians of the Galaxy and, uh... The Suicide Squad. This is not good. When there's blood falling from above, and you don't ever look above. You just run! Run! Powerful evil. Okay. I'm gonna crawl to you. Lock that door! Because you can't, well, you can't get away on a boat, so there's only so many options. That was creepy. And that was creepy. But this August, we have screaming and yelling and weird looking eyes. He's sleepwalking. And that looked like Gabriel from Okay. The night is in blood. blood. Oh, that's kind of creepy. Like one of those, you know, Japanese horror films. We call him Dracula. Oh, I know what we're going to see here. Oh, no, that is... Nosferatu! He's coming! That is definitely Batman. That is Batman. Or Wolverine. Wolverine. That could definitely be Wolverine. But did you see the size that thing? Wolverine's going to fight for three. But that guy did not want to look at the light. And again, Bat dude. That's sufficiently creepy. And that's definitely creepy. Yeah, you know what? Let me off. I, let me out. Give me the lifeboat. Give me a door and no roads and I'll survive the ocean. Because this is the last voyage of the Demeter. And uh, coming August 11th. Now, for all you fans out there who've read Dracula by Bram Stoker, uh, or any of the other renditions that have been around, um, we know that it doesn't end well for the Demeter. Now, the plus side for this is we don't know if maybe people do survive. You know, the, we know the boat, spoiler alert, the boat ends up in London empty. But maybe, just maybe they survive. So, you know, watching this real quick, I have to say that it definitely has that nice little horror theme of it's an enclosed space. You can't get away, which sometimes is good and sometimes is bad. But in this instant, it looks like it sets a nice little atmosphere for uh, for the film and you know what I enjoy a good scary movie sometimes if it's done well and that did, it did look intriguing so you know what put this on your calendars August the last voyage of the Dementor will be sailing into theaters see what I did there so I'm gonna reserve judgment and uh, you know this might be something I'd go see at the uh, the drive-in not with the family, maybe some of the older ones who are less impressionable, but I will still try to scare them because that's my job as a father. But uh, you know what? Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Tell me I'm right. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me something, and I promise I won't cry in the corner for more than five minutes if the lights are on because I don't want a creepy Batman Wolverine looking thing coming after me. But until next time, I am the Earl of Florida, and you are watching the Midnight Magic Musings. Thank you, and have a good evening. Or good morning, or a good day, or wherever you're at. Just have a good one.